One interesting question in philosophy, <laughs> and to live a finite, fragile life in an infinite, eternal universe. So that's not that funny, right? It's a good question. <laughs> what does it mean to live a finite, fragile life in an infinite, eternal universe? And um, I think the answer is that, so sort of paradoxically, whilst we are definitely physically insignificant, I've just said, you know, the Earth is one planet around one star amongst 400 billion stars in one galaxy amongst two trillion galaxies in a small patch of the universe, right? So we're definitely small. You can't argue with that, we're just specks of dust. But if you think about what we are, we're just collections of atoms, right? Some of them are as old as time, pretty much, and some of them were the other ones, everything else other than the hydrogen in our bodies was made in stars, right? So, so we, we all cooked over billions of years. And we're in this pattern that can think. So suddenly, as the great Carl Sagan said, you have a means by which the universe understands and explores itself which is us.